Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the early morning Jija with your host, the one, the only King Fidelis Jr., the first, the Chelsea man, also known as Isaac Baka Bakawan of Nigeria. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a confused Friday. I came to work earlier. I sat in my Japanese tomato that I drive. That one that I was prizing with Nigerian police. Yes, that one. And I came to work after church this morning. I sat down and made a long eight minutes video about love, about healing, about forgiveness. But unfortunately, I didn't show you people. I didn't post it because after making that video, I went to the filling station and I changed my mind that today is not a smoothie Friday. Today is not a healing Friday. That today is wickedness part two. Wickedness part two. Let me shock you people. In case you don't know, be aware. Today is the 10th of February, the day that CBN had said the circulation of the old notes and it's, uh, you know, should stop. But however, that you can return it back to the CBN. The argument is whether you can return it to the bank or the CBN. We don't know which specifically, but he said in his statement, the CBN. So I went to buy feelings, uh, fuel at the filling station. And I thought to myself, oh, the guy has some new notes in his hands. Let me fill up the, the tomato tank, that Japanese tomato. Let me fill the tomato tank. And um, while I am I'm at it, you know, while I'm at it, fill, filling that tomato tank, let me also, you know, ask for some cash. So I'll transfer in excess. And giving him just 2,000 naira. Make I feel go buy a car. You know, man, I just helped myself in the ministry. But unfortunately, this guy told me, no, it's not possible. Co possible? I said, why is it not possible? And he said to me, okay, even if you beg me from now till tomorrow, I know they give you. Okay, no problem, no problem. Oh, yeah, make a fill up tank. You see, okay, you get cash. I say, no. I go use POS pay now. He said, oh God, we know they take POS. So. What of transfer? We know they take transfer. So the update now is that everywhere in Lagos, you cannot buy fuel with transfer or with POS. You must buy with cash. And the cash must be the new cash. To make matters worse, even the old 100, 100 Nera, in the do younger to go later. Mmm. That is the situation. So we are coming here today to talk about wickedness part two. And this wickedness part two is a fourfold wickedness. The first level of this wickedness is one. They have adjusted meter. We know the meter is adjusted. So they are selling at about 255 naira or 315 naira if you pour what is in that uh, jerry can you will measure and see that even eight thousand naira cannot fill a 22 to 25 liter jerry can that is the first fold wickedness the second fold wickedness is they know they collect transfer no if i let's let's reverse a bit first fold wickedness they don't adjust meter second fold wickedness philistines are selling at 185 it is written there we see 215 this one is selling at 215. That is second fold wickedness. So you are selling at a high price for an adjusted machine. The third fold wickedness is you are refusing to collect from POS. You are refusing to collect from transfer. And the fifth fold wickedness, I deign to say, you are insisting you will collect only new cash. Filling stations take money to bank every blessed day. So what is wrong with collecting old cash that you can simply take to the bank 
and deposit. Money where they come for filling station, no be money where they carry go give madam for house, may she cook food. Now money where they go bank, it is in millions on a daily basis. What sort of wickedness is this? This five-fold wickedness. Let me not call your name and your address, O filling station, and spoil your market. But your name. Let me not call your name because it's a, it, there will be a conflict of interest. It get person way way the man way the manager for that filling station way be customer where they work. So make I know make I know even she you get. Just leave the mathematics there like that. But this is wickedness. On wickedness part two, we are come to preach even deeper love that is expected to neutralize this spiritual wickedness. I call this spiritual wickedness because this wickedness no normal. That is what we have waken to in Lagos today. This is what filling stations have kept me discussing for six whole minutes. Is this what the early morning ginger should be about? To talk about suffering? To talk about wickedness? No! The early morning ginger is supposed to be spreading the seeds of love that will germinate everywhere. Oh ye people of Nigeria, finish station owners, beware of me. Yesterday was wickedness part one. Men in black who had me prizing tomato that I drive, Japanese tomato that I drive. Today is me begging just to transfer to buy fuel in that same tomato. Why is this my tomato suffering? Yesterday I spent 20,000 naira to buy tomato that I eventually drove to work. Today, I'm trying to spend for the same tomato to put juice in the tank. As you go out today, say no to wickedness and yes to love. Love is our language. That is what we must show. It is well with you. God bless you. Have a wonderful, gingerful, king, fidelisful, Isaac Bakakbashas, Bakashios day. It is well with you. Never give up. Have hope. 25th of February is around the corner. We shall change this country. It is well with you. God bless you.